All right, if I'm gonna make a video of my uh, Queen F 1582 B16 chassis or WPL B16 chassis. And, uh, I got the metal uh, upgrade, two speed gearbox, and I'm using a uh, Dumbo RC uh, six channel, is it? Yep, six channel radio. So there it is. So I finally got it working. Now to take off the top. Hold on a second. All right, so take off the top. I just pinch both sides and then I pull up, and this gets disengaged from the, uh, the two holes here. There, from here. All right, so I got two ESCs in here. I got two quick runs. This one here is for the uh, for the uh, actuator. I'll put a battery in there after so you can see it. What I've done is I removed the positive from the uh, the cable, or I should say the uh, the connector, okay? Because I'm running two ESCs, so you gotta take one of them off, okay? Or else you're gonna be putting, uh, I believe, too much voltage into the uh, receiver. So, uh, oh, I'm putting the wrong channel, sorry. That's channel three. All right, finally figured it out because what was happening is if I put if I put the uh, the linear actuator actuator directly into the uh, oh, geez. I'm to get it in there. Come on, there we go. Ah, I'm trying to film with a phone is not the easiest thing. Sorry. All right, so turn on the uh, cursor. That's the uh, drive motors. That's the primary. Uh, ESC and the secondary ESC, which is for the linear actuator for the dump. Got the three beats for the 3S. Obviously, you have the receiver on, uh, sort of transceiver on. Then I use channel three. So to go up, I push forward. And she goes up. There we go. There we go. Now she's up. Got a good tilt angle. And what I do after is uh, I put it to the middle. Okay, so then to bring it down, if I hit it once, it won't come down, right? Because it's got the uh, double bump reverse, so I go back and back again, and then it comes back down. There we go, now she's down. There we go. And then uh, I got the two-speed gearbox on the uh, channel three. So, uh, I don't know if you can see it move there. That's my two-speed gearbox. Runs good, now it's on low. All right, so there you have it. This is a custom build. I made it myself. I uh, have a 3D printer and I'm designing some stuff on a free CAD. Uh, so pretty much made myself a chassis or whatever plastic base. And I even made the thing here for the servo. And you see the light flashing down there for the uh, ESC for the, uh, what you call it, for the, the linear actuator for the dump. So if I put it back to the center, the light will stop flashing. There you have it. So that's it. And channel 3. Hey. That was weird. Not too close. Not too close. Yep, yeah, too close to the... Uh, there's your channel 3 for the gear switch. Fast. Yeah. I had it on channel 3. What was cool is when I put it in the middle, it would go into neutral. It would set it into neutral, so if I wanted to tow it or something, I could have, but I don't have a tow truck yet. Oh, did I just say I made a tow truck? I might make a tow truck one day. Yeah, so there you have it. I have a full metal uh, for the heavy duty uh, transportation. Um, my wife has a five pound uh, weight and I put it over here and it went up no problem so oh, let me show you where's the tag oh, on this side all right let's bring her up again that's what I bought linear actuator off of uh, I think it was eBay or Banggood or something I don't remember anyway so you have it there's my chassis that I made I was going to make a different type of uh, dump system. I was going to have the linear actuator in here and have a slide. 
and push up like the original uh, push. Uh, I was going to use the original push rods, but I changed my mind. I went this way because it looks more realistic. And uh, yeah, it's actually pretty fun. I enjoy it. So to bring it back down, got to double bump it. It's back. Back again. And the way she comes down. Last weekend it was mild here. It was uh, shoveling snow with my uh, this puppy here. This makes a difference. This is a mod you guys should look into. Uh, I have a video on that on my channel here. Using a drama. And I used my excavator. That was fun. I put some lights in there. Hey, you know anybody who wants a 1994 URS4? Audi? Yeah, i put it up for sale. Love this car. But things have changed in my life, so better things to do. All right, so uh, yeah. So that's it. So like I said, I was moving snow last weekend with the an ice that was mild out. We got more snow, as you can see. Shit load of snow. Too much. All right, so hope this video helps. If you have any questions, uh, let me know. I'll drive you through it. Well, not drive you through, but help you through it. All right, thanks.